Speaking of tents, Anna, you were looking for a missing couple when you ran into a very tough situation. I did, Chris. I actually went to the sheriff's home looking for answers, and then he made me an offer I absolutely had to refuse. Just who was on the other side of this door? And why was my security team so worried they wouldn't let me go through? It was just a few months ago when I went to Love County, Oklahoma to investigate the disappearance of Molly Miller and Colt Haynes, last seen in a truck being driven by this man, James Con Nip. But it was Nip's cousin who became the real story, a man arrested for multiple corruption charges, including allegedly maintaining a meth house. The former Love County Sheriff himself, Joe Russell. So we, of course, are looking for Joe Russell, the former sheriff of Love County, and this is what we believe to be his home. So we're going to knock and see what the sheriff has to say for us. Joe Russell? Hello? Hey, Joe Russell. Come in. Anna, the look on your face when the security guard says, don't go in there, says it all. Oh, absolutely. And I had two off-duty deputies, sheriffs from other counties with me, and they both were like, no, 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 don't go in there. What did they think could have happened? Well, you had a sheriff who was under investigation. There were allegations that they were actually dealing meth out of this house. So if the sheriff didn't know what was outside and you invite him in, he could have said, all right, that's it, you're on my property. It oh, could yeah. have been a mess. This could have been a disaster. Who's to say, but security was so concerned about safety that they wouldn't let me open the door. So I wasn't going inside, but I still had to try and get the former sheriff's side of the story. Sir, I'd feel more comfortable if you open the door. I'm not opening the door. I ain't got Well. Sir, is there anything that you can tell us about the disappearance of Molly and Colt? Well, sir, I can hear you, so you can just talk to me through the door. No, I'm not saying no more. But, sir, there are some serious charges against you. I mean, the charges are serious, accusing your son of running drugs out of here. All right, sir, nothing you want to say? We never did get a statement from Joe Russell, but a judge did. Just a few weeks ago, the former sheriff was in court to face corruption charges, and as part of a deal, pleaded no contest to willful omission to perform a duty. Sadly, there's still no closure for the families of Molly and Colt, but James Con Nip is serving 10 years behind bars for auto theft and other charges. However, neither Nip nor his cousin Joe Russell have ever been charged with anything in connection with the couple's disappearance. 